Let's have a look at how to create a manga manuscript. Choose New from the File menu in the upper left of the screen. The Manuscript Settings dialog will be displayed. For this document, I'm choosing the purple icon for Comic Manuscripts, and the finished size will be A4. In the finished book bending site settings, you can set the crop marks to be displayed on the canvas. In this case, let's continue with the default settings of 5mm. Next, I set the resolution. When drawing monochrome manga, it's best to set the resolution to 600 dpi. Since we are making a monochrome page this time, I'm setting the resolution to 600 dpi, with the basic expression color set to monochrome. When drawing manga for publication on the internet, it's not necessary to consider a finished book binding size. In this case, select the orange illustration icon when opening a new document. You can set the resolution to as low as 72 dpi. If you later export the file for the web, it's useful to change the units for the page to px for pixels. Set the expression color to color and press the OK button to start drawing. Since we will be drawing a document meant for printing this time, I will click the purple icon again and return to the previous setting. When all settings are adjusted, click the OK button in the upper right to create the canvas. And that's how a canvas is made. Next, we prepare to draw a rough layout. Since the basic expression color of the file is set to monochrome, even if you select red from the color wheel and try to draw lines, they will be in black and white. To draw colored lines for sketches and drafts, set the layer expression color in the layer properties palette to color. With these settings, it's now possible to use any color from the color wheel. Since the document's basic expression color was set to monochrome, all newly created layers will first be set to monochrome. Therefore, if you would like to draw lines with any other color, change the expression color in the Layer Property palette.